probably one of the most important things that you can do to make your website appealing and interesting and bring visitors back again and again is to be able to present them with a lot of beautiful images. The more you can illustrate your articles with captivating images and graphics and maybe even perhaps some video clips, the more likely you will build your audience. And so in this lesson, we're going to show you how you can use a utility right within Joomla itself to manage your media and to upload media from the hard drives of your computer to your server at your host provider. So let's log on to our Joomla account into the back end, the control panel. And the place where we can manage our media is found under content. If you click up here, uh, you get a little drop down menu and one of your options is media manager. Just click into there. You can see here the image we uploaded for our article in a recent tutorial it is now showing up in media manager. Uh, there are also some uh, images here that uh, were included because of the sample data that we installed when we installed our Joomla package. And I have uploaded some images uh, for another tutorial and they're now showing up in my media manager. And at any time I can go in here and uh, manage my media, delete it, add more images. And uh, so it's a nice little utility to become familiar with. Now, first thing I'd like to show you is how you can increase the file size limitation that comes by default. Uh, by default, Joomla sets your file size upload to 10 megabytes. And while that's plenty for most of the still images, well, if not all of the still images that you would likely want to use, because when you upload an image, I know that some of your cameras are probably showing uh, file sizes in 15 megabytes, 20 megabytes, but you always want to, to resize your images before you use them on the internet. And usually, they are resized to be somewhere around the neighborhood of 100K, 2 or 300K, depending on the size you're using. And so when we say a file size limit of 10 megabytes, usually nobody has a problem with that. But let's say you want to host your own videos. You want to upload videos right to your account at your host provider and be able to stream videos from your own server rather than use YouTube or one of these other services. And there's several good reasons why you might want to consider doing that. If you want to upload video, you are going to run into problems if your file size limit here is, is only 10 megabytes. So I'm going to show you how to change that. Go up to Options over here in the top right hand corner. Click on that. And you'll see up here that by default uh, Joomla has set your maximum size in megabytes to be 10. Well, you can change that. I'm going to change it to 500 because sometimes the videos that I upload are rather long and they can be uh, up to 500 megabytes in size. Now, just because you make the change here does not necessarily mean you're out of the woods yet. Uh, it could be, in fact, that your host provider also has a place on your account where it has been set to be 40 or 50 megabyte file size limit for uploading. So if you are trying to upload a video to your server and it's like 300 megabytes and you run into a problem, even though you've set your size here to be more than 300, it uh, is probably uh, something to do with your host provider and you need to be in touch with them using as going to their support system, using their ticket and requesting from them that they reset your file size limit. Okay, let's save and close this and uh, show you maybe briefly demonstrate how you can upload batch images using Media Manager. Let's start by creating a folder. Go up and create new folder. And uh, let's say we want to upload some images to an image gallery uh, from a recent trip that we went on to Nepal. So create a folder called Nepal and then click on that and uh, Let's go and uh, hit the upload button and then we can direct the software to the hard drives of our computer by hitting the browse and that will take me. Now, it, because I had just visited here, it's remembering that I had uh, gone to this particular folder in my hard drives. You're more likely to see something like this when you hit the browse button. And then just navigate to the folder where the images are that you want to upload. And let's see, these are in 
here and JPEGs 1200. And uh, let's just select uh, a number of these by using the shift key on your keypad. You can select more than one. And uh, then let's just hit the open button and then go up and hit the start upload. And let's see, when I've done this in the past, we've actually gotten a dialogue showing the well, it looks like it went ahead and did it anyway. Okay, so you can see how you can very quickly upload a batch of uh, images using the Media Manager. And now, using other utilities of Joomla or perhaps some plugins that access the Media Manager, you will be able to have access to these images that you've uploaded in bulk. Now, I should mention there may be a restriction. In fact, I think uh, you're only allowed to upload 20 files at once, which is probably plenty for most purposes. If for any reason you want to upload more than 20 at once, let's say you want to add you know, a couple of hundred all at once, then I would recommend you using an FTP program. So check out the video tutorial that we've created on how to use and work with an FTP program if you want to uh, batch upload several hundred at once. It's, uh, it's probably the best way to upload that those kinds of numbers is using an FTP program. Now to get back to previous directories, just uh, find this up arrow here in the top left hand corner and that will take us back to our previous folders and uh, allows you to access other parts of your media manager. Just going to check out one thing here before we're finished and see if it's possible to access the media manager through our JCE editor. I've never really tried that before. Let's go back to our About Us article and hit the media. And yes, indeed, we see that Image Manager of the JCE editor by default takes us to the same folder on our server that is holding all of this media. And so if we were interested now in accessing the images that we just uploaded, we could just double click on our Nepal folder and they're there showing up. And as you click on them, they will show up here a little preview. All right, so there you have it, how to work with the Media Manager in Joomla.